exclusive, how gov. El Rufai's orders sent nine Kajuru elders to prison over Emirate Tussle. Governor El Rufai on a condolence visit to the family of the late Igam of Adaro, Dr. Nine elders of the Kajuru Traditional Council are currently languishing in detention at the Kadena Central Prison over their repeated attempts to convince the government of Kadena State to reconsider a village restructuring. Amendment, Order No. Signed by Governor Nazar El Rufai Sahara reporters can confirm. The elders are Engineer Bawa Magaji, Wazirin Adaro, Sani Magaji, Commissioner of Police, Retired Slash Barad and Adaro, Amid Diam Smari, Adari Development Association President, Joseph Abdallah, Adari Development Association National Treasurer, Tankum Smari, Village Head Maro, Hosea Don Lodi, Village Head Ungwangamo, Joseph Ayub, Village Head Kuchura, Tank Wada, Village Head Agub, Alumei Tumbi, Ungwan Bard Elder. A source who spoke to Sahara reporters said, shortly after Agamadara of Adari Kind Gum died in a pre-arranged manner, the chiefs noticed a change in how information was flowing from the state and local government to the chiefdom because the Gazette was being implemented without consultation of the Adara people. Engineer Boa Magadi, Wazirin Adara who stepped into the late monarch's shoes approached the governor through a letter seeking his audience for dialogue to no avail. The source added that in a bid to further appeal to the governor, the Adara traditional rulers took a copy of the letter to the Emir of Zazat to no avail. When all diplomatic efforts failed, the group of elders through a team of lawyers filed the case in the High Court of Justice Holden at Kadena with Sutno. KDH slash COD slash 72 slash 2019 where the first defendant is the governor and chief executive of Kadena State pursuant to section 195, 1, of the Constitution of the Federal Republic of Nigeria 1999 as amend. The elders were however arrested about a week to the first hearing. The five village heads among the elders were told to come for a peace dialogue with Fulani elders in the area, they thought it was a step towards peace so they went and were rounded up after they were made to write a statement while the Fulani Arto was asked to go home. The source added. Link to Kajuru Attacks on February 15, 2019, Nasr al-Rufai, governor of Kadena State on Twitter announced that 66 people were killed in Fulani enclaves in Kajuru local government area of the state. An official report from the state government read, security agencies today reported the recovery of 66 bodies that were killed in attacks by criminal elements on various dispersed hamlets in the Marujida and Iraxis of Kajuru LGA. The settlements affected include Ruga Bahago, Ruga Daku, Ruga Ori, Ruga Haruna, Ruga Yakabubakar, Ruga Duni Kadiri, Ruga Shuyuka and Ruga Shuebuyo. Shortly after the statement which Sahara reporters confirms was false, there has been a wave of attacks on unarmed civilians mostly of Adara extraction by armed herdsmen, the most recent which was the killing of a foreign tourist and three others at Kajuru Castle on April 20, 2019 by armed herdsmen in Kajuru local government area. The attacks have left several indigenous Adara people displaced without mention or attention by the state government. Some names of displaced people. Adara community cries out. Some affected family members are crying out like Mercy Msmari who said, Just thought I should share this, do you know that this is the second time my dad he ate a president Mr. Dio Msmari has been arrested by the Kudana State Police?
the first arrest was February last year when he was called to come and bail some Adar youths whom were arrested after an attack in one of the Adar villages. He got there and they arrested him detained him for three days then charged him to court where he was granted bail, but he kept going for the court case for months before the case was finally dismissed because they couldn't find any evidence on him. This is a man whom has given and is still giving people a source of livelihood in Kajuru local government both indigenes and non-indigenes he has created job opportunities for many in his school, CDI, Community Development Institute, Foundation School. An internally displaced person Shriasana Abdengo said, the Adara nation started suffering displacement the very moment our chief was abducted and gruesomely murdered. We became sheep without a shepherd, vulnerable to all manner of attack, physically and psychologically. We had little or no voice to air out our pains and agony. It is against our human rights as a Dara people under a binded constitution to be divided and possibly erased using political powers amidst terrorism. We suffer severe attack and killings and get compensated by arresting our leaders who are denied justice by prolonged detention. Luca Biniat, a vocal critic of the El Rufai administration recounted his experience visiting the Adara 9, as a former inmate, I was in Gudana prison to see the Adara 9 where they are held with other captives. They looked well but more importantly, their spirit is not broken. We exchanged some wise cracks and it was so nice to see some light moments. Their people are going to terror. The Nine Adara elders of Kajuru in Kadena State remain in detention at the time of filing this report with no known charge preferred against them save four orders from above.